Hola muchachonas, ¿cómo están? I hope you guys are doing awesome. I know it's been like a super long time. Um, life got hard for a while. Um, con la pandemia, um, my brother and my little girl, um, uh, how do I say it? Mm, both have seizures. I mean, my little one hasn't had hasn't had one for about a year now, though. But she's still on her medications, and um, my brother as well. But he's been having seizures, really random ones. And yeah, I feel like COVID was the one that well, no, was the one did the more impact. You know, um, it changed so much. So many people passed away. So many people got sick. We ended up getting sick, but in November. Um, and uh, I still can't really smell. <laughs> and yeah, maybe I'll make a separate video. I'm getting into more detail about everything that happened. And in December, um, I tried, oh, I didn't try, I opened my own little Etsy shop because I'm an artist. Um, I've been drawing for my entire life. Um, I felt like I had to take it like to the next level, you know? Um, because I know I'm good at it. I know some artists choose not to sell it. Um, but I chose to sell my, my work. Uh, mainly because I want to stay home with my kids. Especially my little one with the seizures. And um, I don't really think I'm ready to leave her yet. You know? Well, like a big, with like a babysitter. And... Um, But I also needed to help my husband make some money to pay some bills. Um, so that's what I want to get into right now. Showing you what I have going here. Just in case you haven't seen it. Um, and at the moment I mainly sell these vinyl stickers. I do some of my work and I send it to sticker app and order some stickers. It's funny hand sanitizer. And, uh, my little hand sanitizer. <laughs> um, okay, so with my very first sticker, I had to stay old school because that's that's how I started drawing, right? And this is my Madre Vinyl sticker, which is a 3 by one2 right? Right this way, and I I had to do this first because, like I said, this is how I started drawing. I love drawing ribbons and hearts, and I'm just like a very loving person, person full of love. Um, I had to do this, and I might change it later in the future once these are sold out. Um, make it a little bigger a little more detailed because um now that i'm looking at it i feel like it still needs a little more work um but i love it i used to have this on the back of my phone and i know several other people have it on the back of their phone um i had a customer put theirs um on their coffee cup which is cool because these are you know you can put these there and yes, I started drawing those at a very young age. Um, I would always see my dad, I believe it was my dad, draw this stuff, hearts, ribbons, names. Um, so that's how I started, with hearts, ribbons, uh, sunflowers or daisies, um, and names. And yeah, it's... 
it was a must. I had to do this as my first. And then um, my second sticker, oh, the second sticker I did is a uh, In Memoriam vinyl sticker. Which this one was like dedicated to everyone that passed away because of COVID. But of course it could be dedicated to anybody, um, anybody special to you. Right. This one is 2.2 um, by 4. Get closer. And I do draw these. <clears throat> I don't copy these. They're my designs. I mean, I did grab a picture and put it like side to side for like reference for the rose. Um, I did make some changes to it. Yeah. But like I said, so many people passed away. And it's, it's heartbreaking. Um, my, my husband, he lost his uncle. And it was weird because I liked him. And I mean, it wasn't weird because I liked him. It was weird because um, I too have an uncle named Cristobal. Oh, I don't really like to say it in English, but in Spanish it's Cristobal. And um, I don't know, he was a cool guy. When I met him, the one time that I got to like talk to him, he was cool. He was funny. Um, and yeah, it was, it was hard. It was hard on my husband. It was hard. <clears throat> and that is dedicated to anybody that's passed away, COVID or non-COVID related. And my third sticker is my lady, our lady. So I had to do one of these, especially because I'm, okay, so I'm Catholic and I love my lady. I love her, I love her, and I love her. Oh. So I had to draw one. And then growing up, I would always see stickers of her. Like in the little 50 cent machine. So I had to do one. But she took longer than my other two stickers, and this is a... 3.7 by 4.5 as you can see and I do have her currently on the back of this phone and um, my husband has her on the back of his the back windshield of his car and several other people have it on their have her at on their cars as well um, and yeah She's a good sticker. And then I thought I was like, I felt like deeply in love with this sticker. <laughs> I also did a, a poster for myself. It's currently hanging in the, in my living room wall. And I really like how it turned out. So I ended up ordering um, some little pictures. For people, just in case they want to like frame her and have her somewhere, which currently none of these have been sold, which is totally fine. I'm a really patient person. <laughs> what size are these though? They're like um, four by sixes, I believe. And I ordered these from Shutterfly. They're just pictures. And, um, after that, I created my sunflower vinyl stickers, which is probably the most simple sticker I've, I've done. Um, I literally drew this sticker in a day. Really in like a few hours. Yeah, she's a big one too. It's a 4x4. Four four. Yeah, it's just a 4x4. Four four. <laughs> which is still a little bigger than... It's a little wider than my virgin. And a little shorter than that sticker. Okay. Now these, I do have the option 
for them to be customized with a name. Um, I have one on my laptop. Where is it? I don't know where it's at. Then it has my Marisol's name in white vinyl. I customized him with my Cricut. And um, I'm currently only doing a white matte vinyl. And they do, they are different. The price is different for if you want it just a sticker or if you want a name on it. Man, I ship um, 1250 states. Um, in some, I believe, I can't remember if it's on all my stickers or on my items. I think I could deliver to Canada and Mexico to everyone. And if not, I will look after this and change some settings. Yeah, and that's mainly all I have. I also just recently added my hoodie. My, I keep saying my, and you took it used to saying our hoodie. Because I did it through, um, I got this hoodie through what is it, Printify, which Printify has like multiple options of um, multiple other companies that do stuff like this. So I need to we, we. <laughs> um, they use my art and they um, they print it on whatever you choose a hoodie or notebook, a cup, socks. Um, they have a lot of options. And I got this on a hoodie. Now this one I wanted to put it on, but I couldn't because I bought it for my husband. This is it. This is Nuestra Señora in Spanish, which in English is Our Lady, of course. In the back, it's just Our Lady. And I did do it with the one, the one that doesn't have the words, like on the sticker. And this, I just added this on my Etsy shop. So if you purchase one, you wouldn't just be supporting my business, but also the business of the people that are doing this for me. Because I do not know how to do this. I don't know how to print stuff on hoodies. Um, and I don't have the material. And I don't have the money. I really don't. And for this, I would get a small portion of whatever is made. Whatever is sold. Um, and the rest of it goes to the other company that printed these sweaters and I feel like the cool part also is that they directly ship it to you. Yeah, this is a medium and they're men's, they're men's, but it was because I couldn't find a unisex one so that was awesome. He took off the lace. It does come with a lace. And it is soft from the inside. I can't tell. Oh, kind of soft. It's really soft. Yeah. And that's what I've had, what I have going on. Mm -hmm. It's been a long time. It's been a long time. I want to get back to recording my makeup videos. But we'll see how that goes because... Um, I know I said that I want to stay home. Um, I'm not ready to leave my girls with anybody or my little ones with anybody. Um, but unfortunately, I've gotten to the point where I have to go back to work. It's, well, it's not really unfortunately because now um, I will have more money and maybe a little more money. And have more products new products which that's another thing that my honey my husband invested so much in my business already and it kind of i am grateful but i'm not used to it um i will i'm used to buying my own stuff but because i don't work he's helping me um he bought me my cricket he bought me vinyl he's buying the stickers from sticker app 
um, shipping stuff. Um, oh, I also do cups. Well, I don't do cups. I decorate cups with vinyl. Um, gosh, I should have had some. I did like two for 4th of July. One was a mason jar, mason jar glass. And another one was a wine glass, which those didn't sell. Um, and I'm currently working on some Halloween ones. Which, if you follow me on any of my social medias, um, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I did sell one, and they weren't even on Etsy yet. It's just because I announced it, and it was a really cute glass. I was like, if this doesn't sell, I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> but it sold. <laughs> it sold before I put it on Etsy. And yeah, that's what I do. I don't really do customized cups, like, to ship. Um, or from out of here, I've done a lot of custom cups locally, and just one time I had to deliver it, which was a Mother's Day gift. I am also currently waiting for a new sticker, which um, it'll be here on the twenty eighth or around the twenty eighth, twenty eighth to the thirtieth. Usually it'll be here the 28th or a day before. And, um, I think one of my first products was, uh, original painting of the Shiver Skull. Wait, it's a 4x4, 4x4, 12x12. 12 by 12 canvas panel. And, um, I did it because I love sugar and I love the whole embroidery patterns from um, my people on the clothing, on the women's clothing. So I got that and I just like replaced the little design the sugar skull usually has with the embroidery embroidered flowers, but it is it's not embroidered, it's painted on. Um, that sugar school. I just ordered a sticker and um, a sticker, a few stickers from Sticker App, and um, I also got a different material. Usually, I just stick with vinyl, um, with plain white vinyl. I don't know. <laughs> and I ordered it um, glittery, so that is different. And the rest of my stickers and I'm super excited um, mainly also because it's I think I'm gonna stick with it and make it my logo right now it's mainly just get that sticker um, the sugar skull sticker uh, my Halloween cups oh I'm also doing um, a small poster of what is it Freddy Krueger Michael Myers all those are horror people horror I don't know how to say it. <laughs> I don't know how to say it. Uh, anyway, all the scary movie people. Well, not all of them. Like I said, there's Freddy Krueger, Michael Myers, um, Jason Voorhees, Leatherface, Ghostface, Chucky and Tiffany, uh, Pinhead. Pennywise, I believe that's it. Those nine characters, which are mainly the ones I grew up watching. Um, and I'm just not like, I'm not getting these pictures from the internet and slapping them on, right? I am hand drawing these and changing them up a bit to where um, each character only has one color. So everything else is black and white. And for example, well, I mean, Freddy Krueger has two colors because of his jacket, but that was, I mean, sweater because that's his what his sweater is notorious, right? So I did that green and red, Pennywise, his hair red and his nose and his lip red. Um, Jason Voorhees, the little triangles, right? And his mask, face mask, red. Um, Chucky and Tiffany. Their eyes, which I believe Chucky's are blue and Tiffany's are green. Um, pinhead, green eyes, 
Michael Myers, his blue jumpsuit. Um, what am I missing? I haven't drawn Leatherface yet. I'm currently working on Freddy Krueger. Ghostface, his blade, his knife with blood on it. Yeah, and that's gonna be a poster just because I love Halloween. I love scary movies, even though I still get scared. Yeah. <laughs> I get that from my mom. And it turns out I also get it from my grandmother. Yeah. Please check out my shop and if you know it's not your it's not your vibe, it's cool. Um share my stuff with your family and friends. Gracias, mil veces gracias por su apoyo. And if everybody that supported me, thank you. Muchas gracias. Enjoy the rest of your days. Have a great night. I don't know when you're gonna be watching this. Have a great afternoon, evening. Um, yeah. Cuídense, stay safe. Keep using the hand sanitizer. Um, you are awesome. Know that you are awesome. Um, have your meal. Have an awesome meal. Eat breakfast. Um, eat your lunch, your dinner. Drink some water. Stay healthy. And you're beautiful. Gracias. Mil veces gracias y besos.